Those with a keen eye will have noticed I'm not Chris Northover. Those will also notice that it's beautiful and sunny and we're here in Italy. And this isn't a triumph because Chris rode the triumph just last week and now it's my turn to ride the nearest competition, which is the Tuono V4 factory. Now I was lucky enough to ride the Triumph also last week, but now the guys have sent me here to Mizano to ride the new Tuono. Lucky me. So they've tweaked the engine slightly, it revs a little bit more, same power, same torque, but you've got a little bit more over rev. The exhaust is completely new. The chassis is near enough the same. The semi-active suspension from Orleans is the same. The brakes are the same. But the big difference is the ECU is different, which basically means the electronics are more advanced. To put it in simple terms, it's like getting an old phone and a new phone. Everything happens a lot, lot quicker. So we've had three sessions here at Mazzano, which riding around Mazzano in beautiful sunshine is a lot better than what Chris had to do. But what a stunning bike. I've always loved the way Aprilia Electronics work. Uh, Aprilia Electronics are the, arguably the best of the bunch and they've just improved it and refined it. The anti-wheelie, the traction, everything is unbelievably good. I've not ridden this track for a long, long time and this bike is over 170 brake horsepower so it should be intimidating and it's not. It steers beautifully, it handles beautifully, it is beautiful, it looks beautiful and it sounds beautiful. So the big question is, which you want to know is how does it compare to the Triumph? Well, I rode the Triumph at Donington Park and I rode it on the road. We've not had the chance to ride this on the road. And obviously we're using different tyres in different scenarios in different conditions. The Triumph, I think, may have the horsepower. It may have the engine. The, tri the Triumph may have the brakes in the initial bite. But I think the Aprilia has got the usability and the electronics and I think the handling. So it's going to depend on the track and it's going to depend on the road. But there's only one thing for it, we'll have to get me and Chris together and we'll have a bit of a ding-dong and some fun and I'll try and control the immaturity of Chris.